And I don't even think it's really in the film. Oh, but so... I was, when I say crying, <laughs> I was crying. But also, when James Acaster came in, him and Lolly's like... Oh, my God. ...back and forth was so funny. So funny. Hello, I'm Amy Lee Wood, and I play Queen Dagon. Hello, I'm Nicola Cockle, and I play Humble Joan. And we're going to play Most Likely to with Cosmo UK. And don't forget to subscribe and like. The best ruler. I would trust Lolly. 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 I was just thinking that. Lolly, definitely. I feel like Lolly's got a really good moral compass, as do you, to be fair. But I feel I feel like I would if I so knew Lolly. Do you. Thanks. That's, yeah. I think it's a, there's something about the Virgo. Lolly's I feel like Virgo I, I feel like me... she would I feel like she'd be better than we would at like calling people out and being like, no, this is wrong, you have to do that. I feel like she'd be I'd love to be her advisor. I'd Absolutely. love to like help, yeah. But I don't. I think that I would probably be good for like a day, and then I'd run out of. I'd be like, I'd be, I'm overwhelmed. I, yeah, I cry. I'd be exhausted. No, I think Lali is a good shout. Yeah. I think Nick Frost could. Nick Frost, if he wanted to, yeah. If he wanted to. He if he could. was like absolutely not, like I can see yeah, him. Yeah, because that Aries. I'm doing it all by star sign. Yeah, sign. perfect. But you know, I think there's there's some real fire. In yeah, there. for sure. Yeah. Best at accents. You're pretty bloody good. Thanks. I think I'm gonna go Nicola. Who? I don't know. Have I heard? I feel like Lolly could be. I don't know. Have I heard? Well, Lolly can just like do an impression of literally anyone. I can't do a really impressions. Can you? No, not really. No, no. She's just like oh my she's god. She's like a she's like a proper comedian. Yeah, Lolly, she's so a she... proper and 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 can do all these different. She can just launch into a character out of nowhere. Yeah, that is so specific yeah. and hilarious and. And it's like you're getting a. F it's just it's amazing. And she would do that on set the whole time. Like it would it it was amazing. Yeah, she's and brilliant. it would come out of nowhere, and it would be like whoa. Um, yeah. So yeah, you guys, you two. Thanks. I'll yeah. take it. It might be you, you little giggler. It is. It is me. That's lovely, though. It is me. It is. But there's something quite exciting about that place that you can sometimes get to, where it's like you, you it's you're in you're at risk. It's the most delicious it, it feeling like, in the world. Mm, this is really good. But yeah, I think when I get to a certain place, I find it hard to get back out of it. I get When I get the hilarious, I do find <laughs> it hard to get back out of it. And then, but that can very quickly, like a baby, that can very quickly turn to tears. Oh yeah, full so panic. So I can go from like laughing and then that's kind of the perfect place for me to then do a sad scene. Is if I've just had the hilarious <laughs> yeah. and then someone goes, can we do that scene that's <coughs> devastating? I'll be like, I'm ready. Yeah, yeah, because yeah. Because I'm, I'm on the extreme of the release uh -huh. of the laughter, so then it can very quickly turn to, to crying. Yeah. But yeah, probably me. Oh my God, there was just, there was this thing that Nick did and it wasn't in, even in the script, but when he's, when when we find Bobbick in his little hut mm -hmm. and we we need to be in disguise, so he's, put, he's finding like potato sacks and putting them on us yeah, to yeah. cover my crown and everything. Um, he decided to just start acting like he was a fashion designer. And it was like, he was doing Bobbick, but as like this really like high fashion <laughs> kind of, and like looking at the potato sacks and kind of like, look for, it was so funny. I don't even think it's really in the film, but oh, I was, when I say crying, <laughs> I was crying. But also when James Acaster came in, him and Lolly's like- Oh my God. Back and forth was so funny. So funny. Cause we had, mo we had like more of the, we had more serious. I know. Together. I was like, yeah, because like I was sometimes jealous of the other three like, yeah. on their little journey. Because I was like, I'm just here being evil on my own. Yeah, yeah. we did have. It was quite. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. It's fine. We get to do this now. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Throw the best party. I do like to throw a party. I do like to throw a party. Um, I love a. I love a, a dinner party. But then I always stress myself out too much. I always like mm. give myself a hard time. I'm like, well, I have to make this. And then I'm like, well, this didn't come out right. And you know, the bread is weird. And uh. You are a perfectionist. Yeah. Lolly's also really good at games and-, and Lolly Capricorn as well. Virgo. Virgo. Lolly's very good at like game Love parties. Love board games. And like, she, she always has, like, if you can't, like, she always has a really fun game that you've never heard of, but you're like, mm. oh, that's a really, that I then now do all the time at any dinner parties. Oh. Have you done in the manner of the word? No. 
You have to like enter the, someone gives you a word yeah. outside and you have to enter in the manner of that word. So, that it, and then people have to guess what word you were given. So it'd be like arrogantly or whatever. <gasps> and you'd walk in and then you'd have to like interact with the room in that way. And then people have that to guess. That is great. And it's such a good game. And when she does it, it's like, obviously crying with laughter because she's so funny. She's so funny. Do you like to cook? I love cooking, but again, I get overwhelmed and stressed. Yeah. So, my well, actually, my friend. I was oh, at, Nick's an amazing cook. He is well. an amazing yeah, cook. Maybe it's yeah. him. I'm but, not. But what were you going to say? My friend, um, she's married to a chef, and I make Irish soda bread, and I brought her some, and she literally said to me, "It's better than my husband's," and then told him wow. in front of him. I love. And I was soda like, bread. "I'll make you soda bread." I would love some. Yeah, soda bread. I'll make you soda bread anytime. So maybe you. No, Nick, I think, is the right Nick shout. Because really. he also put, puts it on Instagram, like, confidently. He does. Very confidently. Yeah. yeah. I once time posted, back in the days when I had Twitter, I once posted my roast dinner and people were, like, slagging off my potatoes saying they were too roasted. Rude. I'm sorry, they can't be too roasted. They can't be too that's crunchy. Just that's just... Not, they have to be like, crunchy. That's stupid. Yeah. Well, it's like to start a revolution. God, one of us are pretty. I think all of us are quite... I think we don't shy away from... We don't. No. Now I think all then we'll join join forces and start a revolution together. This cast, all of us are pretty. Yeah, yeah. I think we'd be great. Yeah, we do. Thanks for watching. <laughs>